uh, yeah, no, I've had sex. Like, I've totally been entered, but like, I haven't. There have been penises, like, around. There just haven't. What advice would you give to someone who's a virgin? I haven't decided to lose my virginity yet because I, I haven't found that one person who will open the door to my 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 soul. That's how I look at it. Till my whole body agrees, I won't I won't do it. I've been in situations where I could have, but I'm not the kind of person who wants to lose my virginity when I'm drunk at a party with my friend. I want to be in a situation where I feel confident and I feel in control, not like I'm doing it so I can say that I did it or that I can, you know, finally tell my friends like, oh yeah, it was no big deal, you were right. Like, I don't care about that. Don't let other girls tell you when things are supposed to happen. They'll happen for you when they happen. I remember like being 16, I was taking like a senior gym class or something, and I just remember one girl being like, if anyone's a, still a virgin, then I don't even know what they're doing with their life. She like she said something really mean. And I was like a virgin and I heard it and I was like, oh, okay. So I graduated from high school and was kind of like, I guess I have to get rid of my virginity. First of all, don't ever not do something because you're scared that you're gonna be labeled a slut. But don't also ever feel that you are obligated to do something because you're scared you're gonna be called a prude if you don't. Your virginity is like really awesome. Like, I feel like we need to stop treating virginity as if it's like the worst thing in the world to be when it's not. There's so many other things that you can be worried about besides losing your V-card. Don't say yes just because you think it's the right answer. Know that it's what you want to do. I'm waiting to be happy with myself first. I think that's key. No one can love you until you love you. Don't rush into it because I think that personally I did a teensy bit. Um, and I, I ended up being in relationships later on with people that I really loved and I wish that I would have, you know, waited and kind of had that special moment with them. Relax. The time will come. You will lose your virginity. You don't have to make it happen. Guys are guys. You call them, hey, I want to lose my virginity. <laughs> I'm coming right now. I'm older now, so I feel like mostly people think it's weird. Like, there's something wrong. Like, what's going on with you? Like, why haven't you done this? Like, are, are you okay? I'm like, I'm fine. Like, you just can't handle my hymen. Like, relax, you know? Like, <laughs> it's totally okay to be a virgin at any age. At any age. You should never feel uncomfortable telling someone that you're a virgin. I mean, except for like, if you're like meeting someone at like a job interview, like, hi, my name's Zoe, I'm a virgin. Like, no, that's not necessary. Be upfront about like who you are and like where you're coming from. As long as you can be honest and really just say, in this case, you have to speak. You have to say, okay, I'm a virgin. I don't want to lose my virginity right now. And the guy who respects it, hmm, he's worth keeping. Maybe he might be the first one. You never know. <laughs> I usually go like, can you guess why I don't want to go to bed with you? Mostly guys go like, well, you're on your period or you're a virgin. And I, most of the time have said, I'm both. Is there a problem with me that my uterus is there? No, there isn't. I'm perfectly fine. I mean, if he wants to be with you, he will he should be happy to just do everything else except put his penis in your pants. I mean, if you're good, there are more ways to be satisfied.